We're exploring the UGA Herbarium today. We were established in the 1920s and we have over 280,000 specimens from across the world. There's so much research happening at the herbarium and in order to organize our specimens, we do it by family and also put them in these giant compactorized cabinets. Herbariums are ever growing and I'm working through adding in new specimens to these ever growing collections. They come pressed in newspaper, we mount them on our herbarium sheets and then they'll hopefully last for forever. We are a biodiversity repository and also a cultural history repository. We're looking at how North American bamboo species have changed in response to our changing climate. And we can use herbarium records to help inform conservation efforts. I work with herbarium specimen working on a plant guide to culturally significant plants of the Gullah Geechee folks down on the coast and a way to kind of aid in some cultural preservation and to capture their relationship with plants. We're a leading institute in research, teaching, and service. As curator, I handle the day-to-day -day operations of the GA Herbarium. I have the privilege to train undergraduate and graduate students. I also get to aid researchers in the use of herbarium specimens for taxonomy, distribution, and in molecular work. Not all plants are here year-round or even found in Georgia, which makes teaching collections a great way to study the unique features of plants without having to be out in the field. When we have our sample digitized, we will take the labels and we'll upload them to our digital database. All this data is all now searchable for researchers to use. Hope you love Herbaria now. Bye!